Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Coinbase and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you scan a Coinbase Bitcoin QR code? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video. There's really not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you want to scan a Coinbase QR code? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe your viewers keep wanting to donate to your Coinbase through Bitcoin on your live stream. But they're not sure how to scan your Bitcoin. QR code, whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process and they can actually do it in the Coinbase app. It's this blue and white one right here. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to open up my Coinbase account now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my Coinbase app. This is the home screen here. Now here on the home screen, if you want to go ahead and scan a Bitcoin QR code in Coinbase, what you're going to want to do is click on the send button here on the top left with an upward looking arrow. Once you do that, then you will see a long list of different cryptocurrencies that you might hold with Coinbase. Coinbase. However, in order to scan a Bitcoin QR code, you want to look for this one right here, BTC as an orange logo. Once you do that, then you will see your recent transaction history for Bitcoin that you sent. However, in order to scan a Coinbase Bitcoin QR code, click on this blue button here on the top right. It looks like a little small QR code. All right. Once you do that, then Coinbase will open up your camera so you can easily scan someone's Coinbase QR code to send them Bitcoin. If you haven't given Coinbase access to your camera, you will need to agree to that. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to scan a Coinbase Bitcoin QR code, that is the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.